Hi guys, I'm Zana Roberts Rossi and welcome to our live from E! New York Fashion Week at The Coach Show. Now, as you can see, we're not in your usual, typical Fashion Week setting. We're actually at a place called Basketball City, which is one of the biggest sports facilities in the entire area. Now, there are going to be quite a few guests in attendance and they are VIPs, including Megan the Stallion. So stay tuned because we're going to be chatting with her a little later on. In the meantime, we want to hear what the fans are saying about this show because they are buzzing. Sakura writes, it's always coach for me. Me too, Sakura. <laughs> Jose tweets, I cannot wait for the show and Meg the Stallion. Sarah says, I'm ready for all the coach looks. Me too. Again, I cannot wait for this show to get started. There's some arrivals coming right now, so let's go check them out. I'm so good. I mean, <laughs> it's quite funny to be on a runway with absolutely no one else in here, no? Yeah, I've been getting to a lot of the shows early when it's absolutely desolate ah. and um, it's kind of peaceful, the quiet before the storm. But then you get to see everybody come in so you can do your little like fashion Christian mingle. Fashion Christian mingle, explain that. The door. Explain that. You know, it's like, That's where amazing. are my friends? Who do I want to talk to? You always have to find that one friend in the crowd or else it's like sitting alone at the lunch table That's in true. high school. And if you don't have a friend, make a friend. I had to do that yesterday. Who, who did you make friends with? Kat Graham, she's awesome. I mean, that's not a bad friend to make. What, was, <laughs> what were you guys chatting at? Front row chat is always the best, by the way. What was your banter? Yeah, because everybody's like so electrified. Yeah. Um, well, she wants- I'm equally insecure. <laughs> yeah, right. Like, you know, we just want to be, it's really high school. Um, she had watched me on and just like that. So she came up to me and was so sweet about that. And I was so happy to meet her and then found her on Instagram and it's like, oh my gosh, she's everywhere, everything looking stunned. So shout out to Kat Graham. Yes, you, I mean, just like that, you're so fantastic. And it's literally my favorite show of all time again now. How was the experience working with such an iconic crew? It honestly felt like I was walking in a dream, just like really? crossing over from a fantasy world into a reality world. I never thought that those two things would come together because yeah. that show, I know I'm not alone. It lives in the heads and the hearts of so many women, especially women who live here. It's almost like sometimes in your mind you Religion. live in the show. <laughs> right, because it's it's like a it's like a guidebook and a rule book for yeah. being a woman in a city. Like yeah. that's what the show is yeah. for. Who has sex and loves and um, you know, as an actor, you just kind of show up and do the job and you wanna do the scene and yeah. you don't want to have any kind of like hype in your head. So it was this whole other kind of acting where it's like, I'm sitting in the stall, I'm listening to their conversation oh. in that scene. And you know, I'm trying to actively listen as an actor, but the other side of my head is like, <laughs> oh my God, the Carrie and Miranda are having an argument in the bathroom. <laughs> so it's like double acting. It's like, what's my objective? And then it's like right. fan acting, like, like be cool. Oh um, and your role <laughs> is so much fun. I actually was chatting with Brock. Oh, who I know. Oh. What a sweetheart. Alexa is Alexa so, so adorable and I wish I got more with um, her character, um, but you know, maybe maybe someday. Um, what brings you to coach today, apart from the obvious fabulous clothes? I'm an American girl and I support American fashion and there is no fashion more American down to the DNA bone marrow than coach. You know, I'm carrying this um, kind of Bonnie Cashin style archive revival purse. And Bonnie Cashin was one of the original designers of Coach. And she's one of those names where if you look all the way back to like what American fashion was defined as sportswear, uh -huh. 60s, yeah. 70s, like she is right next to Halston and yeah. all of those iconic foundational figures. And not a lot of people know that she designed for Coach. And Stewart does such a great job of integrating those references. Mm -hmm. And um, it's like the nostalgia meets the pop culture that he does so well. I feel right. Yeah, well, he finds pathways forward to a new definition of an American woman. He takes the past of the American woman and infuses it with the present. Clothes that not only appeal to pretty much everybody, but are in some way accessible to everybody. Right. You know, yeah. this this is this is something that you can go and buy at the mall, and that is fab to me. And it's, it's, you mentioned nostalgia, but it is like, like I think it was everyone's first buy. Right, my of first course. designer bag was a coach bag. Yeah, 
And there, there's actually a classic like house track that I've heard at the club a couple times, like on vinyl. It's like, I need a coach bag. I need a coach bag. I, I need a coach bag. Not anymore, you don't. You got a lovely little one there. Go look that up on SoundCloud or something. <laughs> You're amazing. Thank you so much for chatting. Yeah. Good luck you. on that front row. That front row of scary, oh, scary them. It's, it's gonna, nice to know that everyone feels the same on the front row. You're it's like, going to take everything I got to just sit there and. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Right. Hey, it's me, Ricky, Eddie. <laughs> How, are How are you? I'm so good. How are you? You smell amazing and you look amazing. Thank you so much. Thank Tell you. Me, what is going on? You know, hey, I just felt like when I saw this look, it's so on brand for me. I'm gonna give grown and sexy, and I'm giving that today, even though it's cold outside. But still, it's back. You, are you, you and Brianna are like. <laughs> oh come on, come on, I'll do it. Hey. <laughs> I don't know how she's doing it with all the tummy out. Right? I'm just like, I mean, but this looks like amazing. Wow, I'm so amazed. Like, I, if I were got pregnant, that's how I would do it. Come on. <laughs> anyway, back to the show. <laughs> what you have been in the coach family, I feel like now for quite yes. some time. You've mm -hmm. hosted, literally hosted the last runway show at the TV. Yes, yes, yes. Um, what else has been going on with you and Coach over the last few months? Oh my gosh, coming here, doing different other things with Coach. Like, I'm just so happy to be part of the Coach family. Like, you know, Coach brings me back. My mom, my grandma, my aunt all loves Coach. So right. to be able to work with Coach, yes, I love it. It's funny. It's like everyone references it in, as a nostalgia thing. And oh, everyone in throughout the family. Literally, come on, yes. You know the clothes for today? I haven't. I haven't. I haven't seen anything. anything. I'm so excited because usually, like before the show, I'm like, right. I know what the looks are giving. Yeah. I don't know. I like the surprise though. What do you expect? Just amazing sexiness. I love it. Oh. Just like you. Um, okay, I'm about to interview Megan Thee Stallion. Oh my gosh, my aqua sister. What? Yeah. Oh, tell me what to ask her. Oh how my gosh, I don't know. Like, your knees, girl, how do you do that? Like, <laughs> what? I need some strong knees like you. Come on. I love me some Meg Thee Stallion. Give me a Meg move. Come on. Oh, Come on. ooh, this is my favorite one. Ooh. 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 That's really good. That's really good. Oh, they've been working at you really good. You really have. <laughs> oh, you look amazing. Get a nice fashion shot here. Come on. How's mommy hug? It's so good. It's the best. It's the best, no? I'm obsessed. Like, how is I it? just want more kids now. I just want to keep going. There we go. You hit it first. first. Yeah, more. just drop your them. lead, baby. Yeah, but I had twins, and it was just so much easier to knock it all out in one go. Right? Now I think about that, and I'm yeah. like, that's so great to just like get all of them at the same time. Yeah, but then they're both going to be 13-year-old girls at the same time, oh, and yeah. that is not going to be fun. <laughs> I know. I'm like, I'm praying for you. <laughs> how has it changed you as a person, being a mama? I'm so much, like, less selfish, just more present, more loving. You yeah. Those things anyway. Well, no, but you know, I feel like I was so selfish before, like traveling the world, like only doing like what I want to do. And now it's like, now I'm just doing what she wants to do. Right. And what she, you know. Will you start traveling again and will you take her with you? I mean, I have a few times. Now I'm here alone because I'm just a few days in New York. So right. yeah, it's, it's like, um, yeah. Case by case. Case by case. Okay, but you're still turning it out with the looks. Let me see this. Look at this fashion look. Oh I mean, my god. What are these boots? It's so my vibe. It's like a 70s like ski girl. And like she's cool. She's cool and she's comfortable her. as well, yeah. which is one of our cool, like warm. That's important. Would you say they're the three top things you need for a New York Fashion Week outfit? Um, yeah, right now. Comfy and warm. Like that's on the top of the list. And cute. And cute, yeah. as always. Yeah. Um, you've walked in so many shows. What would be one of your highlights of your entire career? Ooh, I don't know. Such a hard one. Um, no, I've only ever sat and watched it. It's actually a weird experience watching a show versus walking in it. Enjoy it more. I mean, it's much easier to just watch it because <laughs> you don't have to deal with like the hair and the makeup yeah, and like yeah. also you get treated like really nicely. They like roll up the carpet for you. <laughs> when you're backstage, everyone's like pulling you right. and like, ow, ow, you know, it's craziness, yeah. but it's also fun. Like it's also part of it. So I like, I love being able to do a mix. Yeah. But now you're like, oh, I've done that now. Now yeah. I'm a mama, I'm just going to yeah. sit myself on the front row next to all the totally. other celebrities. Megan Thee Stallion is here tonight. Ooh, love her. Love her. Yeah. I'm fangirling too. I'm going to go and interview her in a minute. Any questions I should ask her? <sighs> I mean, the confidence, yes. you know? Yeah. I literally it's like that, oozes. you know? Oozes confidence. All right, I'll find out for us later. Thank you. Watch the space. Report back. Thank you. Oh, 
I'm so happy for you. Oh my God. Say hi. Give him a big hug. Right. How are you? Good, thanks. Diana, nice to meet so you. So nice to meet you, Mella. Amazing. Thank you, thank you very much. New hair colour? Yes, I'm blonde now. It grows on you. It's, it's yeah, taken a bit of getting used to, but it grows you on it? you. Um, three, two weeks ago? Okay. All right. Two or three weeks? Like the perfect moment, then like the roots will come in a little bit and you feel a little bit more. Yeah, exactly. Well, I think what's important is to like make it look, because I am so dark naturally, I like, have to make it look like it's grown out already. Because I've made that mistake before where it's just like a hard line uh, down here. Welcome to the hard line. Oh, I can't see. No, it's dark in here, you can't see. <laughs> that's, not, that's why I just hang out in dark spots <laughs> yeah. all the time. Speaking of, what brings you to the coach show? Just got the invite in the mail, you know? Thought, ah, I've got some time, I should come. Uh, no, I'm really excited for this. I haven't, you know, I mean, I guess everybody because of COVID, but I haven't been to a show or, you know, I don't think I've ever actually been to a co-show. I think it's, this really? is my first one, yeah. Are you in for such a treat? Because the runway, I mean, they just turned this into a whole, like, mad performance. Yeah? Performance, oh my you know, gosh. Like, straight up I'm excited, I mean, it looks amazing. I'm excited for what might, what's gonna come. Um, we're all excited about what's coming, coming for you next. What's happening next? I actually got some good news today, what? but I can't tell, I can't say anything. Please. But it, I can't, I can't. But I'm, I really want to, but I can't. Well, congratulations to their fans. May we be the first to congratulate you on X, Y, Z. X, Y, Z. <laughs> Any Valentine's Day plans? Um, happy Valentine's, by the way. Happy Valentine's. Uh, Valentine's Day plans. I don't know, it's like a nice kind of warm spring. Warm, okay, I take that back. It's not warm, it's freezing cold. But blue spring day, go for a stroll through Central Park on my oh, own. How romantic. Yeah. <laughs> Self-love, guys. It's all about self-love. All right, one fashion tip while we're here at the coach show. One fashion tip. For me, it's accessories. I'm obsessed with jewelry. I love I love statement things. I usually really like layer up loads of necklaces. I think access like sunglasses, I think accessories make the look, always, in my opinion. You always look bang on. Can we have a fashion shot of this awesome? Absolutely. Look at that. We're trying to get some blue in. How many looks did they send over for you to try on? Um, I think three. And this was the first one I tried on. I knew immediately. I fell in love immediately. Amazing. Angus is trying to photo bomb your interview there. Um, hey, it happens. You look amazing. Thank Thanks. you so much for stopping. And Thank keep it blonde. Keep it blonde. You think so? Yeah, for sure. All right. Hi, guys. Hi. Oh, my girl. You look amazing. <laughs> Thank you. Did you all get ready together? No, no, we are no. in the same hotel. Yeah, in the same room. Yes. Was, you know, like, can I have those boots? Can you trade that jacket for me? I want that one. Oh, well, there was there were panic FaceTime calls. Yeah, no, for sure. <laughs> there were panic <laughs> FaceTime. Yeah. I mean, what was the panic about? I need to know because oh, yeah. these look. I, I, okay, listen, my hair is gorgeous. I love it. But I had a panic. I was like, I think I look crazy. And Renee, I need you to tell me I don't. But it's beautiful. Naima, thank you so much. Yeah. I trust you with my life. Okay, Insane, man. right? Did you know this copper wire? Yeah. So it was all over Sergio Rossi's, uh, Sergio Hudson's show last She night. did. She ran hair she for the it. Sergio Hudson show. It was my favorite beauty trick oh, in the yeah. show last night. Gorgeous. Yes. She's oh, incredible. Wow. She's insane. I mean, yeah. So, should we talk about coach? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Let's, let's talk about coach. Well, let's uh, talk can I coach. see these looks? What is this? Yeah. Yeah. Um, a skirt with a heavy jacket. I feel like aqua meets... I don't know. <laughs> I can't, you look very different than your character in the show. <laughs> oh, that's good. <laughs> Tricking people. I put the glasses on. I was like, I need boots and glasses or anything yeah, else. So, so, so good. It's the so bra top. I mean, thank you. Thank, thank you. Today is weather. Yes. Yeah, yeah, it is. Honestly. It's not because it's risky, but it's cool as well. It's yeah. not like you're wearing it. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Um, now tell me about this look over here. Uh, yeah. Pink boots. Low purse, low pants. I know it's pretty, it's pretty sick. We have a collar. The pins are my favorite. The like the what's it called? Soda, stuff like that, or pop, if you will, depending on where you're from. Um, but yeah, I feel like a like a little like swagged out version of myself. Yeah, I feel very much like myself. Yeah, and you, you man. No, you look like yourself. Oh, I thought you were saying I. I was like, man, baby, I. Oh no. 
I'm so not. No, no, I feel like I look like myself too. No, I do. I was like, I was surprised. Like, you Coach do. is doing really cool stuff. You know, I was yeah, not expecting it. I was really like, cool. okay. I I grew up with Coach. You know, like right. I used to go to the Coach outlets with my mom. Oh, like, yeah. give a little bags, yeah. and everyone's like, yes, yes. Oh, and so I was expecting like what I knew from Coach when I was like 12. But this yeah. is so like yeah, elevated and like so just so dope. So with that is like perfect. We love it. Well, it's awesome. you all did, and um, we all did. But the nostalgia of it all is what's so special, yeah. right? And I think they do that so well. Like they mix like the pop culture yeah. with the old school. Do you remember your first big purchase? Yes. Go. Oh. Okay, so when I when, <laughs> when I got my first job, I went out and I bought a pair of Louis Vuitton boots, and oh, my mom was like, "What the f are you doing?" And I was like, ah, oh, I just thought these boots were cute. And I'm and making you know a paycheck. What? They're worth it because you wear them still. I wear them all the time. You know, but it was ridiculous. Exactly. I shouldn't have done it. I was like 19. Yeah, you know, hey, yeah, you know what? You're right. You, know you what? want them once. By yep. the way, I've been staring at your boots. So it's been yeah, a conversation. I've been trying not to buy those. Don't talk about those ones yeah, in this show. Anyway, sorry. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't remember my first big purchase. I don't even know if I've had one yet. Okay. Like a really big one. You just go on hauls. Like yeah. you, like she'll ball out. Kind of she'll ball out. Oh, I still want to come shopping me. I should have come to the hotel and hang out with oh you guys gosh, later. All right, one styling trick from each of you. Uh, a messy bun can still look fashionable. Very true. Yeah. Uh, layers with everything. Layers and hats. Put a layer over anything and you're straight. No, uh, mine is just wear whatever you want. Yeah. Don't care. Yeah, that's true. Go to the hardware store. The gold. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Yeah, Copper yeah, wire. Yeah. Copper wire. <laughs> Amazing. Fashionable. Yeah. There you go. You guys, I, I can only imagine how much fun you all had shooting the show together. Yeah, it was Such the best. So, fun. Fun. so good. So much fun. Yeah. yeah, it was basically just like messing around professionally, and but messing around. Not getting laugh. paid for it. Yeah, <laughs> and also trying not to get fired. Yeah. Which is good. Yeah, <laughs> it's always good. game. You're not going to get fired. You're amazing. <laughs> oh, thank you so much, girls. Thank, thank you. you. You're awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Tell my mate coming in. You want to come sit with Can me? Can I? Yeah, please. Would you like a rose? Would you like a rose? I would love a rose. Okay, let's it's trade roses. Oh my gosh. It's happy okay. Valentine's. Happy Valentine's, guy. What's uh, up? Any plans? Oh, I'm going to do this and then I'm going to go to bed. Me too. Yeah, so I feel like I had like a Valentine's weekend, and now I'm well, did you do very fun? sleepy. Um, what did I what did I do? I cooked food. I, I live in the city. Yeah, I cooked food. I ate food. Hung out with friends I hadn't seen for a long time. It was really nice. Very inspiring to go outside in this weather. Anyway. Uh, no, although I will say, like room service in bed, watching the snow fall was kind of. Dreamy. Exactly. Okay, I'm gonna move the next one of those. Anyway, we're here at Coach. Yes, we are. You are so such a proponent and always sporting coach. I love it. Oh, I love Stuart. Why, why do I like Stuart so much? Stuart's the designer of Coach. Stuart Babers is the designer of Coach, multiple CFDA nominee. Um, yeah. You know, he and Coach as a family have embraced me since the beginning of my career and through everything over the last, I don't know, five years that we've been working together. So for me, it just feels like family. And I love his vision. I love the choreography of all the shows. Everything feels alive. Like it just feels like fashion in a really exciting way. And it's modern, but it's always the heritage that we keep on referencing exactly. in it. Um, what is one of your favorite coach pieces you own? Because you must own a fair few at this point. You know, I have a fair few. I will say that. I mean, all of the leather goods are incredible. I have like six biker jackets in different colors. Those are my favorite. And also I'm like deeply obsessed with this new little puffy bag. He it's so gorgeous. cute. And if you get a bigger one, it's a good nap pillow. And that might be, I was going to ask you your Fashion Week tip or hack, but that could be it. Um, only go to one show. <laughs> then you're not exhausted, yes. like me. <laughs> In bed, watching the snowfall literally, with a takeout. Yes. Do as little as possible during Fashion Week that you don't have to do. <laughs> you're such a season pro at that point. I mean, that's sort of like, I used to think it was, I've been learning the power of no this year and saying no more, and it's been very, very effective. Thank you. I love seeing you as always. Thank you, Thank so you my love. Oh, it's so pretty. She said, oh, it's Happy true. Valentine's. Happy Valentine's. Enjoy the show. Thank you. You too. It's good. Nice to I'm meet you. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. You said your name, what? Zana. I'm Angus. Nice to meet you. This coat is everything. Yeah, it's, it's nice, so right? Good. I like the green. How many looks did they send over this morning for you to try on? 
Uh, they had they sent a couple of different jackets. You feel me? But you know. So yeah, good. They're, they're cool. Uh, yeah, I yeah. like I like this. I like this. It's good to hide from the pets outside. <laughs> Something like that. How is Fashion Week treating you? You're doing quite a few shows, right? Bouncing around. I'm 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 here. You feel me? I'm out here. You know what I'm saying? Like it's fashion. Fantastic. What else are you gonna do this week? Anything fun? Oh yeah, I'm gonna do something fun. <laughs> For sure. No dot, doubt. dot, dot. <laughs> <laughs> no clues. ETC. Yeah, no, I, I don't make plans like that, right. but you know what I mean? We're gonna get into something. Did you, is it true you got discovered in New York City on the street? I was doing um, my research like five minutes ago about you. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> nah, they just asked me on this. I was walking down the street, yeah. They asked Incredible. me to come uh, try to be on TV or whatever. How's the show going good? How's the show going? Yeah, yeah it seems to be going good. I mean, if <laughs> they do a good job making that so, well, you know what I'm saying? We love watching Thank you. Thank you, I appreciate that, you're for welcome. real, for real. Oh, nice All right, you. bless your heart. Thank yeah, you. we're going. Bye. Sure. We're just charging in. No, Ernie! You, I feel like it's our like biannual date now, the coach yeah. show. Yeah, yeah, I, I remember seeing you. We, you talked with Blake and I. That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And how has it been since? It's been amazing since. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's had, having fun, trying to make a, yeah, just trying to make the best out of everything. Well, so. this outfit is killer. Tell Thank me everything you. about it. Thank you. Look at I mean, yeah, a little clutch, but I kind of, I decided to keep this on. I was like, should I just take this off and just kind of hold this? But I kind kind of adds to it, holding it, like and having this hang down. But yeah, what you look the amazing. What? Thank you so much, Coach. Obviously, head to toe. Um, what is it about Coach that you love and that keeps on bringing us all back every season? Um, what I love about Coach, uh, I was just talking with a few of the guys backstage. Um, Backstage. Well, we were doing some like media stuff, like some press stuff. Um, but one of the my favorite things about Coach is like how on top of their media they are. Like it's really cool because as an influencer, content yeah. creator, whatever you want to call me, uh, I have like an appreciation for it because they're killing it. Like we literally like felt like we filmed a movie back there. We right. had so much content with, with social, um, had like direct. It was really cool. So. And obviously the clo clothes are great. Yeah, but it's so important, you're absolutely right, like to be modern today and in this world and so yeah. relevant in pop culture as well, exactly. they do it really, really well. Yeah, they're really adapting to like the new trends. Uh, and I feel like a lot of like some fashion brands like aren't really catching on exactly right. quite yet of right. like, I don't know, like incorporating like cool social aspects, like social media with all that stuff. So. But Coach kills it, well, and it's I mean, really fun to be a part of. To have your approval is everything. Um, no, it's nothing, but... <laughs> oh, no, please, come on. I mean, you kind of know what you do when it comes to that. I'm looking at the Sheer shirt, because it's such a look. Yes, I, am I love Sheer. Okay, so guys at home, this is the top tip. Yeah, Sheer kind of just... It really... I, I feel like it can really make or break an outfit. I think it just pulls... I, I think it pulls it together. It yeah, and then, like, adding this layer. Kind of nice. I'm, not, I'm not stripping him down. I look actually in the middle of a runway here. It looks so good. Thank you, thank you. Any plans tonight for Valentine's Day? Plans tonight? I mean, unfortunately, I'm not with uh, my girl right now. So we'll figure it out. We'll do something later. Uh, probably have some things I'm going to send to her. But like I've been telling a lot of people, we're kind of keeping things offline. It's and since we've been doing so, it's been it's been good. It's been kind of like a weight off the shoulder in a way. Nice. Yeah, right. it's been nice. Yeah. We kind of just enjoy time together rather than like seeming like we do it for our fans in a sense. Right. We're doing it for each other, and that's what it's all about. So. I love that. Fully respect that. Thank you. Um, and with that, send her a coach bag. What's that? Send her a coach bag for Valentine's. Might as well. I'll give her this one. I'll give her. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, have a few, I, have a, I have a few more that I think I could give to her. Amazing. Yeah. Thank you so much, Noah. It's so nice to see you. Good seeing you as well. Keep that entire look. Thank you. Thank you. How are you? Oh my gosh, look at this hair. I mean, Harry, what do you think? No? It matches the I'm for the red, the rose. <laughs> Happy Valentine. Thank you. Happy Valentine. You are, the hair's matching, the rose is matching, everything is on I point. I love it. <laughs> Do you have any plans for this very special B day? Oh my goodness, um, lots of plans. I feel like Coach is number one, and then maybe some Valentine's Day chocolates later. Oh, that'd be nice. <laughs> and then just staying and hanging out. Exactly. Are you, do you live in New York or are you LA? I live in LA. Oh, yeah, yeah. Nice but I love New York. 
But oh, this co coach coat is giving me warm. <laughs> um, you've been doing the rounds. I saw you at Christian Siriano as well. How was? He's, He's a close friend. He's so nice. He's such a good friend. Yeah. Um, what brings you out for Stuart and Coach today? Well, the Talk clothes, the, the fashion. Honestly, the fashion. Yeah. <laughs> and it's just incredible. I'm. It keeps me warm in this cold, cold weather. Is there anyone particularly you're excited about seeing here today? <gasps> ah! Um. Megan Beach Honestly. Yes, Meg Thee Stallion, Anna Wintour, of course. Do we see I, her? Maybe we'll I go don't know. I don't know if she's here, but I love her. <laughs> What's next for you with the music? Um, well, I have a lot of surprises coming up um, with the next single and the next album era. It has just kicked off, so I'm so excited. Well, thank you so much for stopping with us. We've been a bit to our seats. We've got to run. Thank you. Happy, happy. All right, guys, the coach show is about to start, and I'm going to go and get my seat. Don't forget to stay tuned for after the show with the interview with Megan the Stallion.
I mean, I just want to launch into this amazing outfit, but <gasps> we are backstage at the coach show with Megan the Stallion. Uh, how cool was that show? Um, it was amazing. First of all, the first model I noticed was the dog. And I was like, <laughs> y'all know y'all could have called Foe up here and he would have did that proudly. Oh, no, <laughs> yeah. Of but I appreciated the dog's hair. <laughs> dog's hair. I appreciated the girl climbing out the back of a car and I wasn't expecting it. It was yes. so shocked. No. So, okay, <laughs> I'm, we're not even going to talk about it. But yes, it was epic. The mood was epic. Before the show even started, it was crickets. I said, are we outside? I loved it. Really good. Yeah. And this outfit. So this is a custom ensemble today. Yes, this is custom <gasps> to Megan the Stallion. Oh. You know, we make um, hot girl coach designs. They did it specifically for me. It's hot girl. And some, yeah. and some extra hot girl in there. <laughs> okay. Um, you are the face of the campaign again, the second time round. Oh my, how was the shoot? How was it? Um, so much fun. Yeah. Um, every time I link up with Coach, it's like, my family, cousins, yeah. what are we doing today? Yeah. So, I mean, every time it's gonna be a movie. I'm the hot girl coach at this point. Coach. 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 <laughs> okay, this is what we do. <laughs> Give me some behind the scenes gossip. What was going on? How was, how was the driving a bumper car with those nails is all I could focus on? Oh my God, no, first of all, so the, the people who, <laughs> who I was driving a bumper car with, like they were not taking it easy on me. <laughs> so that was like real life reactions. Like they were bumping me left and right. And I was like, Jesus, okay. <laughs> Calm down. Let me get it's the camera, a commercial. Right? Yeah. <laughs> it's a commercial, but no, they were not they were not taking it easy, but it was so much fun. Oh, your looks were amazing. Do you get involved in the styling behind the scenes on something like that? I feel like everybody at Coach knows me so well. Right. Like they don't even give me an opportunity to want to change anything. It's just like, no. yes, I will wear that. Yeah. Thank you. You know me. I like that. They're like, crop it and make turn it into booty shorts. She'll love it. Booty shorts. It was <laughs> yeah. like literally the booty short with all the different tops for this. Yeah, as well. it was epic. Um, so, Coach is obviously your family for a long time, but to me, it always brings back nostalgia. And I think so many people think about Coach as their mm -hmm. first. That was, I was in the third grade with my coach wallets and wristlets, and I've been on this. So, this ain't even new to me. <laughs> What was in your coach wristlet back then? Stickers and lip gloss. <laughs> What's in your coach bag today? Stickers and lip gloss. No, <laughs> my cell phone and lip gloss, though. <laughs> What's the weirdest thing you'd find in your coach bag? Maybe you have to pause the camera for a second. <laughs> oh, oh, lip gloss. The only thing that That's can it? fit in here. <laughs> and I have my shades in my hand. But I didn't even know. get to like really like pack my bag, but the number one thing I'm gonna have is my lip gloss. Um, when it comes to fashion, you are a legend and you do everything with such confidence. It's funny, I was talking to a couple of people out there and they're just like, her confidence, it's, she just oozes it. Like, what is the secret? Um, I mean, if you, can we curse? I was about to say the B word. Okay, but, <laughs> right? Okay, I'm not gonna curse. If you just know you're that girl, yeah. you just have no choice but to be that girl. And I feel like I'm that girl. What if you don't wake up feeling like that girl? How do you be that girl? You need to go back to sleep and wake back up again so you can feel like that girl. You've just flown in, literally. Did you do a red eye last night from the Super Bowl? Yeah, I got here at like five o'clock this morning. And you look like that? Yeah, because I'm that girl. <laughs> the hot girl coach. <laughs> living it. Um, Grammy sees around the corner. Congratulations! What are we wearing on the carpet? I don't know. Oh. We need a custom. We need a custom coach, that's what we, we need. This would, this would actually completely work on a Grammy's cup. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What's coming up next for music for you? Any teasers? Um, Y'all know I like to keep the hottie surprise, but she want to pull it out of me, but definitely right. we're getting new music and I don't think y'all will expect this from me. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. it's, 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 it's different. Um, the, the next thing y'all will hear from me is with somebody you might know some, somebody you might have guessed before. I don't know. Oh, this is hot news, hot news. I might even say anything about it, but the next thing is going to be fire. Exclusively here on H. It, she, it's because I'm in her bedroom that I just felt comfortable opening up. I, mean, I invite her in, and this is what happens. It's Valentine's Day as well. It's love day. I just it's felt like giving day. some love. What are you going to do tonight? Um, I'm probably going to go on a little date or whatever. So we got to get up out of here so I can go see my man. Oh, oh, oh. where are you gonna go? Dinner or staying? I don't know if you, I've got a nice bedroom if you wanna hang right, out. I'm just gonna get in this bed and call it a day. <laughs> um, and is it somebody's birthday coming up? 
Yeah, my birthday is tomorrow. Shout out to me. Shout out to all the Aquariuses. Well, I'm Pisces next week, but we still. Okay, because I love Pisces. Because we were meant. Yeah. We're going to stay in the bedroom. That was pretty much it. We're going to bed. Thanks, guys. Bye. You're amazing. Thank you so much, my love. Good night. Bye. Oh, come on in. Come on into our bedroom. Okay. I'll keep everything. Everything. You got it. Got everything. But you already have this is no, no, no. custom. Yeah, no, no, custom. Straight from the runway. I'm just putting this in like yeah. a psycho. But those pink glasses? Uh huh. I was dying. I said, why don't I have those? I'm gonna get you on the phone. Uh, <laughs> he's gonna get you on the phone. Does he just speak? Does he just call you and say, come on, we got the campaign? I, if I literally had his number, I would call him too much, so don't give it to me. <laughs> What, I mean, what advice could you give her, style advice? I mean, not a lot, right? I don't give any advice. Yeah, at <laughs> zero. Yeah, yeah, 100%. Like, yeah. Like, whatever she wants to do, I'm yeah. like, okay. yeah. scoot on in. We're going to scoot on in. Congratulations on that amazing show. Thank you. Thank you, you so much. It was amazing. Thank you. Thank you. Y'all might have to put four for, as the doggy. Yeah, I guess um, so. But the dog was. The, no, the dog was a miss. Right. I said, oh my God, the hair. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> But it was, um, it was amazing. We're having a casting Thank conversation. You. Right. <laughs> okay. So, what is the piece you're taking from the runway? I'm taking all of the shades, all of the bags. And then it was like a, a graffiti jacket. I knew you'd say this. I said, girl, where's mine? <laughs> I need that. <laughs> Can we hook that up, please? Of course, of course. <laughs> I mean, yes. The answer is yes. Why cast this one in the second campaign, apart from the obvious? Yes. I think it's not the second. You've done more than two. Yeah, but yeah, it's, yeah, it's, yeah. It's like right. <laughs> many, many campaigns. Um, I, I just love Meg. I just, I, that's, I think it's all got to come from a real place of, yeah. like, I just think, I just think you're amazing. Aww. Yeah, hey, yeah. Really, uh, I thought it was a dinner. Yes, it and was after, after a show with, yeah. It was after a show, yeah. and the first time I ever met you, I don't even think you were in the yet. No, no, no. And I was just like, I love you guys. Like, I want to be your friend. We were talking makeup. Like, yeah. I was fascinated. Well, I mean, this is... Didn't you do your own makeup a lot? I was doing my own makeup for the uh, longest, <laughs> but now I have... <laughs> now I don't have a lot of time. <laughs> so I got my girl, Lauren, and she's yeah. fire. Well, you need to use that time in hair and makeup to like actually either sleep, catch up with sleep, or oh, we prep. Oh, don't sleep. We gotta be hot girls all the time. We don't sleep. We're busy. We're busy. Give me a couple of highlights in the show from you personally. What would you? What would the oh, with the gosh. key looks? If someone's gonna go and right. take away one now, what'd it be? I mean, it has to be a sterling coat. You know, yeah. that um, has to. Be, I mean, the the trench that. Because this genuinely is. These are all pieces from the show. Because I shared with Meg. Um, so some of the collection and so we made this specially for her <laughs> doesn't come. matter what we say right now <laughs> 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 it's like yeah. <laughs> <laughs> really amazing and the graffiti pieces are without doubt do you have a design motto i think it's just about having fun i think if you have fun yeah. in, in when you're creating hopefully that comes through mm -hmm. when you share the collection that's thank you thank you well we have one ask there's a Grammy's red carpet coming up and we need something like this. <laughs> we just put it on document that we asked. There we go. Done. There you go. Thank you so much, guys. Oh, thank you thank for, you. so much for allowing me into your bedroom or the other bedroom. I don't know. Right. Amazing right. show. What a killer show. Coach took us back down memory lane to a home-like suburb with a few surprises like giant Afghan hounds and girls emerging out of random park cars. The fashion was super romantic with grunge, loads of hardware, graffiti, 70s, loads of big boots, oversized silhouettes, and of course, loads of bags to shop immediately. Now, I think, I'd always say that coach is a lesson in core. And that front row, oh my gosh, like the cool kids that we all want to hang out with, especially Megan and Angus. Sat in the front row, chatting away. Guys, Coach has so many fun accessories. Boots, bags, all the streetwear. I, don't, I'm, I just can't even pick one. There's so many, but if I had to, I'd say the graffiti splattered clothing was probably up there for me on my definitely must buy spring list. Now, I do hear a rumor that it's someone's birthday. It's Megan's, and there's a little surprise about to happen for her. Watch this.
Happy birthday And with that, I want to thank you all for joining me from our live from Eastream at Coach. I'm leaving here thoroughly inspired by graffiti. I hope you are too. Live from me has some exclusive access to New York Fashion Week, so be sure to stay tuned for more fun and fabulous fashion all week long. Bye, guys. <laughs>